gazing far into the night. I raise my hand to the fire, but it's no use, cause you can't stop it from shining through. It's true, baby, let the light shine through. If you believe it's true, baby, won't you let the light the night i raise my hand to the fire but it's no use because you can't stop it from shining through it's true baby let the light shine through if you believe it's true baby won't you let the light Good afternoon, everybody, and welcome to Saturday FPL Live with myself and Jason. Yes, the boys are back in town, as Dan always used to say. It's been a while for myself and Jason to be together, but yes, it is, of course, the 3 p.m. kickoffs where we'll be covering all the goals and assists as they go on. But first of all, before we get to any of that junk, happy birthday, Jason. Welcome. Thank you, thank you, thank you. I've got um, I've got a stinking cold at the moment, um, but and I've just literally had a stinking game of bowling. Um, for both games, I I didn't even manage to get over a hundred. Uh, the closest I got was ninety nine in the in the two games we played. So really bad game of bowling. So I'm hoping my FPL uh, turns out better this weekend than my game of bowling. So, um, but thank you so much, Steve, and thank you everyone else that's given me well wishes for my birthday. Um, I'm just happy to be here, tuning in. Uh, listening into the radio and, and following all the action live with you and uh, drinking out of the uh, 
bespoke elite FPL mug. Yeah, I mean, talking of drink, and I've got a bit of a, well, it, it, not quite a surprise for you, but it is. It was supposed to be for you. So, legitimately, I was going to buy a birthday cake today, and selfishly, every time a goal went in, I was going to take a, a slice of birthday cake on your behalf. But oh. for me, every time a goal again. But the problem is, is that a member of staff at work, Morgan. He um he didn't know about this, but seven o'clock in the morning he just oh came up to me and said there's a there's there's birthday cake available and I was just like, oh, um it'd be rude not to eat it. So I'd like your birthday cake seven o'clock in the morning. Anyway, I am still going to be doing the challenge, but with with something better instead, from the well, teeth with crisps. Um, we've just uh, I, I just literally well crisps crisps um okay I I'm just literally blown up, blown up away by Gabriel's erop uh, oh. with a with a donation of five euros. Uh, thank you, Gabrielle. I thought uh, you were going to uh, say 500. Uh, no, it wasn't. Oh, my God. Yeah, Resi Desi, sorry, with a donation of five euros. Um, <laughs> sorry. Happy birthday, he says. Happy birthday, lad. Uh, and then Paulie uh, with a donation of ten, uh, $10 towards the stream. Thank you ever so much, uh, Paulie and Resi Desi, uh, for those generous uh, donations it's my there. Happy birthday. Donate more. <laughs> It goes, it goes straight back into the channel, and um, you, you guys are really. Another one there, Jay, 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 James, what? Jason. Oh my We've god! Got another one for you, and another what? one. Why is the chat not working? What's going on? Why is the chat not working? I can't okay. believe this. Having technical issues, Jason. <laughs> yeah, well, no, the chat's not working on the stream. Oh my god, that's not good. Um, but thank you, thank you, thank you, thank you for for what, all these so kind. Um, just to let everybody know, half of that's mine. <laughs> Here we go. <laughs> Here we go, here we go. Here's the chat, all catching up. Thank you, thank you, thank you. Um, Dre Zera, you are an absolute legend. Dre, you can be my PR guy any day. Uh, you, you're just uh, uh, incredible. And uh, John Harris, thank you, my friend. Um, is that is that a, a sorry, is that a, like a commiserations uh, donation for beating me in the uh, Champions League, uh, John? Um, thank you, thank you. Um, thank you, FPL Maestro. Thank you, Blue Nathan. Thank you, Salt Said. Thank you, The Don. Uh, Resi Desi, um, again, thank you, thank you. Uh, Anna Rag, I can't say thank you enough, really. All of you guys for being here. Um, looking forward to these three o'clock games, and I'm hoping there's going to be lots of goals. I'm hoping we're going to hear Steve go, Stop! Hang on! Stop! That was an amazing what an cut. What an edit that is. It's my favourite. Um, and going through these McCoys, lovely McCoys, flame grilled, so flame grilled. Oh, hold on! Jason, you got another one? Oh, there's another one come through. What's this? What's Andreas with the 50 knock? Um, thank you so much, um, Andreas. It's, it's, honestly, you don't need to do it. Um, you know, I, I'm just happy to be yeah, here. Yeah, they do, Jason, because I get <laughs> off of it again. <laughs> <laughs> they just want to see me in my cringy dancing. That's what they want to see. Um, Switched off Twitter yesterday, I went with KDB, triple captain. It's becoming toxic at this stage with scaremongers trying to trick managers into making different calls. Um, I, I I think, hashtag play your own game, mate. Uh, I mean, you're, you're captain in KDB. I, I respect that. I really do. Um, Gabriel Duroff is now um, there with the uh, five euro donation. Thank you, Gabriel. Um, Steve, um, I need to I need to ask you. Um, I one of the things I did when um, the game we refreshed was check to see what you did with your team. Um, <laughs> Steve, Steve, are you at the point now? Where you're just thinking Sterling's oh. going to blank, or are you are you still optimistic that your transfer um, for Marnie out for Sterling in is actually going to give you a net a net positive? What happened today in the Liverpool game? Remind me. Well, Marley got a goal and an assist. Yeah. So, uh, essentially, I knew you were going to ask this question. And, uh, in fact, right, what I'm going to do deliberately is... Right, just hold that. Can you just continue chatting for two, two seconds? I just want to play something. So, just continue chatting for two seconds. I just want to play something, and then I'm going to try and find the right thing. You'll appreciate this in a second. Okay. Send, send more money to Jason, everybody. <laughs> right, keep on keep on chatting um well okay not so cool you owe me 20 knock mates says simon j what's this give us some knock uh, norwegian currency it's uh, is it the krona corona norwegian norwegian corona uh, oh, oh are we gonna get demonetized saying that word corona uh, so, uh but um the, i like the stream lads come on only like only not 11 likes so far in the stream guys um we've got 
65 people tuning in at the moment. Uh, please hit that like button and help us grow the stream. Uh, Robert Dinsmore, how are you doing this uh, this afternoon? Uh, did he transfer out Mane? Oh, well, we'll have to find out in a minute, won't we? We'll have to find out. Um, will the elf or bear get chucked uh, against the wall or chucked to the wall? I think that... I want to see what Steve-O's wall looks like on the other side because um, some people say that there's fist marks um, there's, in that wall. And I'm... Uh, I'm, I'm I, I think that wall's probably seen a bit, fair bit of attention in, uh, in the recent months. Um, I need a I need a Bamyang to haul massively, says the FPL Maestro. Um, that would be really really nice. I think um, a lot of people have got him in the top ten k. He's the most captained of all players. So, um, but I still think there's massive gains if he is to haul because a lot of people went with Salah captain and Salah has returned. But I think the uh, the chances of Bamyang beating Salah in a points haul is decent. Uh, Godwin Affer is on the opposite end of the spectrum. He's hoping for an Aubameyang blank. Um, so yeah, it's just going to be it's going to be a very polarised FPL community when it comes to Aubameyang. I think if you own him, you have probably captained him. If you haven't owned, if you don't own him, you're wanting him to blank. Um, so hopefully Steve-O's back now. Uh, I, don't, I think he was just taking a phone call. But um, Doherty and Size Hall, please. Uh, I'll take a Size Hall. Um, I love the stream on a Saturday, lads. Nice escape from reality for once in a while. That, I'm glad. I'm glad you enjoy uh, tuning in. And, and a lot of people they have the game on, and they have us next to the game, so they can follow the game and us and uh, how everyone reacts to it. Yes, Steve, go on. I'm going to play this, and uh, actually, actually, just. Karen Chan, sorry. I, basically, these voice messages contain a lot of swearing, and I don't want to um, have swearing on the show. So keep chatting. I didn't even check the whole voice message. So Karen chatting, and then I'll be able to play it, hopefully. You, you're going to really appreciate this, by the way. Uh, I have literally no idea what you're talking about, Steve. <coughs> but for some reason, my. For some reason, my um, internet's at 100%. So let I me mean, quickly just get out of this. One second. I think Steve-O may be um, listening in to something. I'm not quite sure what. Oh, sorry, guys. I'm just going to close a few tabs down because it would seem that my uh, CPU is literally melting. Um, what is that, Steve-O? Right. I think I could be... I think I fixed it. I think I fixed it. Um... Thank you, Harbour Boy. Thank you, thank you, thank you. What did you think, Steve? What did you think of my um, outdoor stream earlier on? Apparently, um, sorry, just to interject, and, and Ketia has nearly had an opportunity, Jason. Oh, the games have kicked off. Yes. Oh, it's three o'clock already. God. Yeah. <laughs> have we got anyone that wants to come on as a correspondent for the games? Feel free. What did you think what? of my um, outdoor stream earlier on, Steve? I could barely hear through the wind, but um, yeah. <laughs> I loved your stream last night, to be fair. Your stream last night were, uh, was fantastic. But just, just listen to this, right, okay? So this was recorded at 12.53. This was recorded at 12.53 this afternoon. And uh, you're going to appreciate this, Jason. So this is pretty much going to sum up it, everything what you were about to ask but if everybody just wants to listen in hopefully everybody will be able to hear this Jason I'm sure you should be able to hear this so here we go but but Steve -O, Sterling I, I what I just uh, I don't understand your logic Steve -O. I know you say you don't care but but Sterling and Mane's just gone and scored two goals. What were you thinking? Jason, I don't care, mate. As I've said a thousand times, I'd rather just talk about the real-life football. But Sterling, captain. <laughs> yeah, you, predi you predicted the future, Jason. <laughs> did you hear that? Yeah, I did. I heard that really, really well. So, yeah. That what? was a voice message to a very close friend of mine, Mr. Reed, And it's... It, that that is what I sent him at twelve fifty three, and uh, lo and behold, Barney went and got a goal and assist. You, you cannot make it up, Jason. You you cannot make it up. Well, I can because anything I do essentially um, goes the complete opposite. So if I'd have said, I don't know, Sterling captain the other day, 
I uh, wouldn't have done it. And then Sterling goes and gets a hat trick. Now I've done it. He's going to do nothing. If I'd have taken out Salah, he'd have got a goal and assist today. It doesn't matter what I do. It, I just find it hilarious, to be honest with you, Jason. But I, I did. I was really looking forward to today. Uh, legitimately, I was really. Looking what do you forward mean you was? Um, You're still not looking forward to it. Oh, sorry, wrong terminology there. <laughs> I, I was really, really enjoying. Um, the build-up to this particular game. It's the most excited I've genuinely been for a game week, uh, let alone a double game week for a very, very long time. And because it's going to be so different from everybody, there's so many people uh, captaining different players. Uh, there are going to be people that are captain Salah, people captain... I know Davey FPL, for example, I watched his stream. He captained Mane. You've got Block FPL that looks like he's going to be captain Doherty. I don't know if he actually did or not, but we can easily check. Uh, myself, just... Just thought to hell with it because the plan was this. I was going to find out the early team news and if Mane or Salah weren't starting, I thought, right, I'm going to just bring in Sterling and Otamendi in for Sainchu and whichever one didn't play. And then I found out that both of them were starting. I thought, do you know what? Stuff it. Let's just have a laugh. And I just did it, Jake. I just did it. I just thought, do you know what? Let's just have a laugh. And if he does anything, he does anything. If he does, if he goes and explodes, he goes and explodes. But... I may as well just have a bit of fun, Jason, to be honest. Without but it wasn't just team, it so. wasn't just Sterling though, was it? No, it was Otamendi as well. Yeah, so let's just bring your team up on the screen. So would you could you just remind people who you got out for Otamendi? Sainchu. Sainchu, yeah. Yeah. I, I are you not so so obviously your plans for Game Week thirty one? I don't, mate. I, 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 like I said in the voice message, I, I honestly don't care about talking about fantasy football, so to speak. Planning chips, anything. I'm just literally doing it week by week. If I feel like doing a chip that week, I'll do, <laughs> I was even thinking of doing bench boost. I really was thinking of doing bench boost. I'm more in. Look, this is no joke. I'm more interested, and I've said this before. And I apologise for boring everybody. I'm more interested doing these streams with yourself or listening back to streams like you did yesterday and today then I am actually interested in my own fantasy football team. I'm literally just doing it week by week. And I'll just continue for the rest of the season doing that because chip strategies, game week strategies, I couldn't care less, mate. I really couldn't care less, my friend. And uh, yeah, but go on, I'll ask them questions if you want. But uh, I mean, I mean, you've pretty much covered it, to be honest with you. I just wanted mm, to know what your thoughts were. I mean, the end of, this season's it, been, it's just a, a, a joke for me, Jason. You know what it's been like. It's been absolutely laughable. I think you cursed yourself at the beginning of the season by pointing out your record of having a good season, yeah. a shocking season, a good season. And you're like, and also, uh, you kind of resigned, you said, you, <laughs> yeah, well, that's it. You resigned yourself to the fact that you're going to have a bad season straight from the beginning. Um. I'm not saying that that's the reason why you have. I mean, it's been you a very, very frustrating well, season. Jackson. I was going to cheat today and I was going to copy a very famous fantasy footballer influencer. And I was going to copy his captaincy, which was Pepe. Okay. And he's going to be captain Pepe. And I thought, Do you know what? I might just cheat, just copy him because he's doing really well this year. He's, uh, he's like top 5,000 or top 10,000, whatever. And I thought, Do you know what? I'll just copy him. But I didn't. I, in fact, I could play another voice message that I actually sent Mr. Reed. It involved Vince Chapman, but unfortunately I can't because it involves a lot of swearing. But basically, <coughs> Vince on the stream I did the other day said that one of his mates that's doing amazing, every time he brings in a transfer, always pays off. And he's brought in, he brought in Sterling this week. And I just thought, hmm, may as well cheat. May as well just copy that guy because <laughs> my season can't get any better. I did a minus 12. I rose 100,000 places. <laughs> 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 yeah it's just it's just hilarious mate like I, I, say, I think I think Fornell's just got a yellow card anybody get him on the double game week <laughs> yeah Samir was uh, I think getting him in Samir K who came on the show the other night <clears throat> It will be interesting, though, if, um, what do you call it, Arsenal, uh, sorry, if, as Blue, Mr. Blue Nathan is saying, Kevin De Bruyne does go havoc against Arsenal. Uh, Mr. Mr. Blue Nathan also making the point, Magnus Carlsen also went for Sterling captain. I just find it mad, Jason, like a, just a punt that I decided to go with, so to speak. 
Phil is saying number one overall has Sterling in this week. I mean, <laughs> could be a good omen for you, mate. I was going to get an Aguero and captain him, Jason, legitimately. <laughs> but I couldn't afford him. <laughs> <laughs> My mate, top of the cash mini league, captain Sterling. Oh, Vince, Vince, you've just joined us. I was just slagging you off, mate. We are just talking about you. This is why I went Sterling. Your, your thought pro, your mate, influenced me, my decision. And I just felt like going through with it. So Vince, <laughs> Hugh Patrick Campbell, I'm with you, Sterling Captain. Well, let's just put it this way, Hugh. You failed miserably because I'm going to be failing as well. <laughs> when uh, Sterling doesn't play. Is there something going on? No, uh, no. Nah. Championship. Yeah, they essentially like uh, Davey P said about oh, the... Oh, oh, Haller, very close. Antonio, very close to putting in Haller. I'm assuming you went to Bamiyan captain, Jason. I did, yeah. Yeah, yeah, it makes sense. You confident with it? Um... I I, I I think it was the best it was the best captaincy option in my team, yeah. So yeah, I'm am I confident about it now I've just seen Mane Hall and Salah get a goal. I mean <laughs> yeah, yeah, yeah I am. I, I still think he's got the the ability to get something against uh West Ham, um shaky defence and um even arguably against City, to be honest with you. Especially if City try to open up you know, try to be an open game. A question for you, were you surprised that I benched Fernandez? Who's be who benched Fernandez? <laughs> Me. No, you haven't. Yeah, I have. No, you haven't. I've got your team up front. What? Don't you dare tell me Ings is on the bench. Yeah, he's on the bench. Oh, fuck's sake. Ah. Oh. <laughs> You're joking. This is deja vu. I'm sure this has happened before. Are you serious? I, I've literally got your team up on the screen right now. Oh, you're f fucking right as well. Damn, that didn't go through. <laughs> ah, I legitimately. Ah, oh, that's annoying. I'm gonna go ment. I'm gonna go ape shit if things scores today. Stevo, St don't get angry. You don't know what's gonna happen yet. I'm, I'm playing. I'm playing for Matt. I'm playing Fernandez as well. Yeah, but I don't. Yeah, but I. Sorry, let me just make this point. I changed my team. Okay, admittedly, it was like literally the last second. I swapped out Fernandez for Ings because I just think Fernandez is going to do nothing against City. Damn. How annoying. <laughs> Brilliant. Welcome back, Steve, oh. for a three. Oh. Oh. Okay, so Catch my. Chris now. Febi Febianski um, to the rescue. And Ketia running into the box. A bit end to end this uh, West Ham Arsenal game. Well, Arsenal West Ham game. It's a question. Did Davy Davy P bring in Ozil? Everyone that owns Ings is, has had a sigh of relief now, with Steve. You know that. Yeah. Of course they. <laughs> of course they have. <laughs> That's really annoying. Damn. Oh, wow. Well done, a man, Dylan. He's benched Danny Ings. He's playing a 4 5 1. <laughs> Captain de Salah. I want to look at. So, did, did Davy P bring in Ozil? Yeah, come on, teams. I want everybody Salah. to stop. Salah in chat has said that Ings scoring will make the stream funny. Yeah, there'll be a lot of swearing. What? More swearing? There'll be more swearing, yeah. I'll just play the voice messages. Uh, and uh, Davey P did not bring in Ozil. I'm just hoping now Ozil goes and gets three assists for someone. <laughs> Uh, wow. Another hoops, uh, a sympathy uh, super chat from another hoops. Ings on the bench. <laughs> Classic Stevo. No, to be fair, hold on a minute. <laughs> hold on a minute. I actually did deliberately. Obviously, I deliberately benched Ings because I just 
it's just his form has just been terrible of late. And I couldn't bench Jota or Jimenez, and I didn't want to bench Saka because I just thought, you know, I think Saka, I'm just going to back my man. I've been saying it all along that I think Saka's a great player and he always gets assists. But anyway, I just thought Saka over two games may get more than more than Ings. And I genuinely did bench him, but then I thought, uh, maybe just put Ings in because he's playing Newcastle. But like I said, it was last second. Last second decision making. So Fernandez does really well. Obviously, I'm going to be um, happy, but a uh, bit unfortunate. I'm going to see who's shown me the Mane, what he's done this particular game week, Jason. Yeah, no worries. Shocks uh, myself whenever I look through. Hold on. Saka born into the box. Talking to Saka. <laughs> <laughs> I think this. Um, oh my goodness! I'm just changing my 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 web my micro settings. Some... Yeah, what's up? You've got to look at show me the Marnie's team. You've got to. Why? Please, have a look. <laughs> hey guys, I'll get them now. <laughs> Do you know what? I made a packet of crisps just for that. Beautiful Marnie. It's got minus twenty. <laughs> And look, bench boost. <laughs> what? <laughs> and look at look at one of his players, Jason. Lacazette. <laughs> I swear he's just uh, I just I can't get I can't predict that guy. It's fantastic, isn't it? Absolutely fantastic. <laughs> Oh, come on. He's Get currently 66,000 in the world and done a minus 20. Um, and the transfers he did were... Oh, yeah, good point. <laughs> uh, Lacazette in for Vardy. David Luiz in for Dinya. Vardy... What? Oh, yeah. What? Oh yeah! <laughs> <laughs> right. Fantastic! Go yeah, on, go through it. I want Shemi Mane to come on here and explain to me what he's doing. Because <laughs> at this point, I have literally got no idea. But he's ahead of me. <laughs> he's like the hokey cokey. I'll see, you, I'll see you as I'm passing you, mate, on the way up. <laughs> that is fantastic. Oh, Coventry scored against Ipswich. <laughs> Where's all the goals, Steve-O? Goals coming into the box. Deedee's in there. And, of course, it's come to nothing. <laughs> Absolutely. Would anyone else risk not having many, any Devil Game Week players? Says Paul Mantle in chat. I think quite a few people have um, not got. I mean, mainly it's De Bruyne, isn't it? It's the only. Uh, lots of people have only got one Devil Game Week player in De Bruyne. I think people that don't have De Bruyne will possibly. Uh, I'm talking like G Wiz, who took him out, but did make some good transfers. But I think that De Bruyne is a is a key key player going forward for City. Oh, hello. Yeah. Oh, Leno did enough. <laughs> Leno did enough. Yes, another save. I like it. I like oh, it. Oh, of course. You got in Leno, didn't you? Yeah. So what did you think of my transfer, Steve-O? Never, I never got to uh, find out what your thoughts were. Uh, what was it again? Leno? I did in... butter. Butter. But butter. Can't believe it's not button. I got rid of him. And I, brought in, and I brought in Leno for Button, and I brought in Saiz for Pereira. Yeah, I think they're very... They're, no, when I was watching your stream or listening, whatever, to your stream early, I was just like, yeah, solid moves. Genuinely very, very solid moves. I think it makes sense bringing a double game week player for a non-playing player, let's be honest here, and Saiz for Wolves, one of the best defences in the league this season. So... I think I think yeah, fantastic, uh, fantastic moves there. 
Uh, are you actually excited for this double game, though? I... I don't want to jinx it, but I I, I, am, I am actually excited for this game week, this double game week. Um, I'm really looking forward to the uh, Man United Man City game, the Manchester Derby. I think it's going to be really good. I wonder if Vince Chapman. I wonder if you did Captain Jota. Oops. Vince Chapman said he's going to Captain Jota, but I reckon he may have bottled it. What do you reckon? Has Vince Chapman bottled it? Well, generally speaking, he tends to go ahead with what he's uh, he's saying he's going to do, and he's gone ahead with it. Yeah, I, I, I've not known Vince Chapman to to back out of a of a captaincy. Well, you know, it's, uh, I, I don't want to. Um, I'm sorry, Vince, to tell you this, but you think I'm bad when it comes to jinxing players. Um, I've got some bad news for you, Dan brought in Jota this week and we all know Dan's history this season anybody that he brings in fails miserably you're lucky he's even started today Vince <laughs> <laughs> oh Chelsea Fly has become a he's a member now is he yeah yeah, yeah he became a member thank you Chelsea the, the, the other evening when we were chatting on Discord um... oh fantastic brilliant Playmaker or um, the other one Grassroots Playmaker I believe oh really Fantastic. Oh, we've got a... Tri did Daily Lama triple captain Salah? Oh, did he, he do it? Did he? Well, he, he, put, it on, he put it on Twitter. On, he let's, said... put it on, let's go into the host of Moderators League. Yep. Uh, Daily Lama, where are you, Stevie? <laughs> did he do it, Jason? No, he didn't. Ah, oh, damn, because someone's mentioned that they have uh, Hacken. Hacken, I triple captain Salah and took out Mane to fund the Mammy Hang. <laughs> Good. <laughs> Don't worry, mate. I got rid of Marnie as well. Uh, you don't get sympathy from it from me. <laughs> That's Jason's job. <laughs> uh, too funny. Absolutely fantastic. Can I ask Jason as well? When Alison got injured, what were you thinking when you found out yesterday? I was thinking I could make them the best of a bad situation. Oh, oh, Socrates Jason, tell us about it. Abamyang to Socrates just over the bar. Oh, he hit the bar. Apparently, he says Paulie. Paulie, come on, come on, join us. If you got, if you got um, the game on, you can actually tell us what's going on. Um, so it was reacting on to what the uh, radio is saying. Hello, guys. This is Bilal. Just joined. Did I miss anything in the 3 p.m. games? Currently, on 33 points after Liverpool game. Uh, I tried to Discord and join, but it couldn't let me into the chat. Email Discord to try and sort it out. Okay. Uh, you just... Discord's working fine. Would have been an orbit for Bamyang Assist. Yes, JB10. Yeah, I heard that. Um, yeah, so answering your question, I just wanted to make the best of a, of a bad situation, really. Uh, and that was just purely to, to get rid of Button, a non-playing play, uh, goalkeeper that is... Um, He's taking up a bench spot when I want a bench boost. So you're actually like properly planning, aren't you? For well, I'm like just, I'm, I'm, I'm as best I can, considering I'm I've got only one chip left. What what is like your ambitions this season Top now? Now K. we're coming towards the end of it. Top 100k. <clears throat> Maybe top 50k, but I think top 100k. And then reassess come game week 31. Please turn down the mute. You're well, playing music, are you, Jason? Well, I, I just had some background music on. Jeez, guys. It was like, you know. I didn't appreciate it, I, I guess. I, I obviously, the, like, 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 as we know, me and yourself very rarely get to, to chat with each other. It's only usually when we're live on air. But seeing as Daily Llamas here now, um, I think his podcasts are absolutely fantastic. It's a great addition to our yeah, shows. Oh, definitely. Yeah, definitely. And um, now he should hopefully in the, well, after the stream, in the next few hours, he should be also be able to, to post onto Twitter as well to let people know when he's doing them. So, um, yeah, I think, I think it adds a great element to, to the community um, to talk about the Champions League, which we don't, 
have a lot of time to talk about in general. So um, yeah, absolutely agree with you. And I've told it himself. I think it's a, a great addition to the uh, the shows that we have on here. You had last night or the night before, the night before that, whenever your stream was predicting the, the game week, you had Dread FPL on. Is that JJ Man or is that someone completely different? They no, sound the Dread FPL. very similar. I don't, know, I don't think it's JJ. I, I've seen him a lot around Discord recently. You see, he's, well, he's in the chat now. Dread, let me know if you're JJ Man in uh, Discord because you sound very, very No, he sounds, uh, like similar. Moss. he sounds like Moss off the IT crowd. Uh, no comment. <laughs> It's not him either. I heard you on planet. Oh, by the way, Jason, you won't know this. So basically, um, Dread, Sultan Saeed, Charlie. No, I know FBL this. FBL Anderson. I know, I know this. They're in the. They're in the uh, James's live stream. Yeah, it was great. They overtook yeah. it. Was, it was like listening to a, an elite FPL podcast. It was fantastic. Thank you, lads. Cheers. Um, John Harris was there, of course, as well. Yeah. Uh, cheers, everybody. <laughs> It was a very, very enjoyable. It, Dread does work in IT. It, it really... tells people to turn it off and on again. Oh, can we get a go? I want to eat some crisps. <laughs> <laughs> Steve is wasting away here. What's going on? I'm getting skinny. <laughs> what are your thoughts on McDonald's, Jason? <laughs> I don't eat it. Not anymore. I don't blame you. Not anymore, anyway. <laughs> exactly the don where are the goals christ's sake i think we're we're cursed every time we do a a, set, a saturday fpl together steve are we uh of recent it's not been a, a flurry of goals i was hoping today would be a little bit different same here uh in answer to mr blue nathan i got my favorite flavor which is cheese and onion mccoy's um just to change it up a bit salt and vinegar and to get massive steak version, flame grilled. So there we are. So you get a set of arms. <laughs> <laughs> uh, Marshall matters. I really do appreciate what you've put, but you've completely forgot the one, the major talking point is the fact that I am, um, I've got Ings on the bench when I was too late at changing my team. So for anybody that is joining, I am. Um, was too late to the well, not too late to the game, but I was too late to save my team, and I accidentally um, team back up on the had screen. Ings on the bench, <laughs> and I went mental. <laughs> there you go, is your team back up on the screen, Steve? Um, who, <laughs> who's who's gonna, are, are you going to see Ings? Oh, no, you're not. You're not going to really see him, are you? I think you're not going to have him as a jammy auto sub. No, oh, absolutely not. No. <laughs> Uh, Uncle Juicy TV's got a question for you, Jason. When's your cap? Well, when's both your? When's anybody's captain of a Bami? I'm going to do anything, Jason, today. Five minutes uh, says uh, Mika in chat. So goals coming in, in the next five minutes. So everyone blame Mika if it doesn't happen. <laughs> almost got an assist. Gineppo is being reviewed apparently for a red card. Oh, really? Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> it's a red card oh it's a red card red card for Gineppo wow uh, obviously someone actually had him in their team ages ago Southampton but... down 10 men what a shame lads <clears throat> wow hopefully um, hopefully uh, that... Ralal is saying, do you think this Aubameyang hype is inflated as he blanks in 31 and everyone only brought him in as it had an extra fixture, which is Man City, so he's unlikely to score more than a goal? I, I think I think any player really is overhyped, to be honest with you. I think like people like myself who kind of went a bit... not It wasn't panic mode, but... For example, today, getting rid of Mane, I know exactly what's going to happen. If I'd have just kept my team as it was and just kept... Kevin De Bruyne was captain I, I'd be up by a lot of points after this particular game he finishes let's just leave it at that apparently so, the, just want to mention that apparently the referee used the pitch side monitor Steve-O blimey yeah. we've got a goal at Selhurst Park at last hooray alright Crystal Palace 1-0 Ben 
Then take it on the board. Anyone, uh, anyone th- got to Foster in this week? Jordan, are you? Oh, Jason. Finally. Oh, my God. Jordan, are you? I was actually looking at him. <sighs> Thank God. Modern Palace? Stop, sir. <laughs> he'll, get, he'll get a goal in a bit, don't worry. Ben Teke, another assist for Ben Teke. Mm. Mika, he yeah, helped. fair play to Mika. He said goal in five minutes and uh, fair play. What flavours are those well, crisps, Stevie? This is um, this is a cheese and onion flavour. Cheese and onion. Ah, fire tog. Don't talk your mouth full, Stevie. Fire tog. Just want to say th- thank you for that podcast you did with uh, Daily Lama on the Champions League. That was superb, mate. Really, really enjoyed it. And I'll make sure that you and... Uh, uh, what's his face? Uh, Daily Lama do a continued podcast um, for the weeks to come regarding the Champions League. For some reason, Steve, when I switch to the uh, the other camera, it it's, it it slows the I guess down. I need to work that out. This is something which uh, I'll solve for the next stream. You're the tech. You're the tech guy, Jason. <laughs> yeah, it's you're, weird. You're the it's strange. Might need to close some things down. Hang on. Enjoying those crisps. Oh yeah. The problem with um, crisps is that they're very. What's the you, word? You More... eating a bag of crisps for every goal it goes in? No, 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 no. Just a packet. Do you really think I'll. Well, I could. What if there was like 400 goals or something? <laughs> no swearing after the Albuna. Only me. Steve, we've got a bit of AS- we've got to have a you ASMR, a- ASMR stream of Steve eating crisps, guys. Everybody's getting angry, Jason. Stuff them. Our stream, do what we want. <laughs> <laughs> well, what's this, Mister Blue Nathan Doherty head bang shotter? What's going on? Jotter's down receiving. Tr- Dan. Dan, you've done it again. Mm. Mm. Doesn't Charlie have a thingy? Who? Uh, Foster. Charlie? Yeah, he might have. Yeah. I'm sure he does. In fact, I'm certain he is, because he was on your stream the other day. Let's find out. Um, uh, thank you, Paul Mansell. Jota's going to be looking okay. Yeah, he does. The... Well, he has got Foster. Yeah. So we've had one goal in 33 minutes. And it's, of all teams, Crystal Palace, a team that can't score goals and can't even do anything at home, have scored the first goal at home. Yep. Cannot make it up. Uh, while we're at a boring note, everybody, just to let everybody know, I'm going to be covering the Burnley versus Tottenham game. So, just if you want to stick around for that, by all means, there'll be a quick break, and then uh, we'll um, we'll be going lo- live during that particular uh, fixture. So Jason, why don't you tell us about your bowling? Because this is exceedingly boring, and I wouldn't mind listening back to you telling us about the bowling tomorrow morning when I'm at work. Well, tell I'm tell us about to, your bowling. I'm trying to improve my game of bowling. I'm trying to get my game a bit better, but it's not seeming to work. In I'm literally I slam the ball too much when I when I when I bowl. I I'm not I don't glide it as well as I should. So I'm, I'm trying to get better at it, uh, but I'm not going often enough to uh, to perfect a, a technique and. Uh, 
Yeah, might have to just go there on Sunday because apparently it's two quid a game before well, midday. So- yeah. Well, well, <laughs> that's very good, Vince. We need Dan. Well, I was going to do a stream with Dan, actually. Yes, but I wasn't. I asked Dan if he wanted to do a stream about defending Arsenal, but... Um... <laughs> Uh, Uncle Juice TV watched an EAW recently Steve the pay view was also awesome. right so simply the simple answer is this technically yes a friend of mine linked me to the pay-per-view uh, resolution that happened the other day but unfortunately they took it down and then they put up two someone put up two parts of it but then they took down part two so I only watched part one I only watched the Dustin Rhodes versus Jake Hager match which was absolutely superb I think what they're doing with Jake Hager is absolutely Brilliant. I think just making him a dominant force, making the Brock Lesnar essentially of A and E, but just a skinnier version. That match was absolutely fantastic. And the Young Bucks versus Kenny Omega and Hangman Page, uh, brilliant. Other than that, um, I don't I don't watch it for the main reason that it's just the same matches every bloody week, and it just bores me. Every week it's just the same old thing. So yeah, I, just, I don't really watch it anymore. But yeah, so I was going to get Dan on and just to, to get him to defend. Arsenal players, but at the moment, Jason, nil nil. Are you a bit worried with your Aubameyang? Do you reckon Aubameyang's probably going to score against Man City rather than today? I'm not worried, mate. I'm not worried. It's still early days. There's only 35 minutes been gone in the game. Very true, yeah. Uh, Bilal, I watched AEW for the first time last night. It looks decent. It is, it's very good. I'm not going to lie. It's just every match, though, is just exactly oh, the same. Oh, United won. Oh, go for it, Jason. Hang on. No. Billy Sharp. It scores again. <laughs> Who got the assist? Oh. Get to it, Chris, again. You may have to loot me, Jason. <coughs> Dole Vinegar. Oh, I, I'm not going to bother. Is it a Basham, apparently? A Basham. Assist. Oh, yeah, Lundstrom started today. Did he? Yeah. He actually. Oh, apparently Lundstrom is. What? <laughs> <laughs> Lundstrom assist. Fantastic. Wow. We all got rid of Lundstrom. Boone, How many Newcastle made? For a hit. Only Newcastle may have scored, but it's gone to VAR. Oh, really? The Sal's apparently. Hmm. Newcastle got a goal ruled out. It's uh. It's offside, it's offside, goal ruled out. Oh! In Ketchia. Ketchia. Yeah, no, saved by Fabianski. This is great, Steve-O. We should just, just watch Steve-O eat. Ooh. Juggernaut's bench boosted this week. Did he really? Hmm. Yeah, Balao. Um, Balao, if uh, you don't know, basically any time a, a goal scored, I'll be eating a packet of crisps. That's why I'm hoping for 20 goals so I can eat... No, wait a minute. I'm hoping for 24 goals so I can get through 24 packs of crisps. Unfortunately, we had two. Two. <clears throat> we're, g- we're gonna lose viewers, Jason. They're getting annoyed at the noise. Oh. Have you, JB says, have you had any tattoos, Steve? Sorry. 
Nothing. Say it again. No, that's <laughs> fine. Uh, I, I, I'm, I'm shocked that we've not seen more goals. Have you seen the games, Jason? I mean, I mean, Crystal Palace versus Watford, awful. Hardly going to contain goals galore. Sheffield United in Norwich, hardly going to be goals galore. We've got um, who was the other team? An absolute rubbish fixture. Like Southampton, Newcastle. I like, Newcastle. Pack, uh, I like porn cocktail. Yes, I do. Uh, Southampton, yeah, versus Newcastle. Wolves versus Brighton. I said it on the stream the other day when predicting. Wolves hate playing teams like this. Arsenal West Ham. That was the only game where I thought, you know what, there could be a few goals in that. Well, no, actually, no, I didn't. I said it was going to be a tight game, and it wouldn't surprise me if West Ham got a draw. I went two-one just to Arsenal, but they're all just terrible games. Oh, have you tried Tato's crisps? Apparently, never. Stop. Oh, just why from West Ham, Jason? Yeah. <laughs> Apparently Pepe's looking really dangerous for Arsenal. Oh, Jason, wouldn't it be so funny? Well, it would be for you, but if Arsenal just blank this particular game, we... it'd be all right for you because you've got Leno. They keep a clean sheet. That's a, that's a beautiful differential. Um, It's all on Aubameyang for me, to be honest with you. I'm relying on him. Oh, there's some great fixtures next weekend at three o'clock, which we'll be able to, well, if you're available, which we'll be able to cover. Fantastic. Man City at home to Burnley. That's five or four or five nil. Arsenal away at Brighton. Norwich Southampton. That could be entertaining. Uh, Salah and chat's got Lundstrom coming on for Robertson. I'm lucky, he says. Oh, really? <laughs> Oh, actually, I'll tell you what, seeing as someone's just mentioned this, another hoop. So I'm going to put something up in Discord's team screenshots, Jason. And have a look at this, what I saw when I went to the... Oh, yeah. By the way, for anybody that's going to be coming to London to visit and do the tourist stuff, if you're going to go to the Tate Modern Gallery, don't bother. It's rubbish. But um, only go there for the views. But I'm going to post something in the team screenshots, Jason. And you're going to love this. This is what I would love to do. Um, I'd love to do this as a, a donut challenge. Here we go. Let's just put it in there. And uh, I'll be able to show you. You're going to love this, Jason. This is in a... Uh, when, on the South Bank, they always have these really posh donut shops. And have a look at the ones that I'm about to post up now. Absolutely delicious. But more importantly, because I know you can zoom in on this. More importantly, look at this one. I was going to buy this for 12 quid. So they're really expensive luxury donuts. But this one that I'm about to put up now, I'm assuming you're bringing it up for yeah. 12 quid. Oh, fantastic. <laughs> there was one donut that was like a Mars bar version. I was just like... That's a 12 pound donut. That, that pink giant one, yeah. It's massive. All, all the um, all the donuts are like six, seven quid each. <laughs> so That's mental. Oh, they're all they're all located like on the underground tunnels below, around the South Bank area in uh, London, around um, oh Paulie, we've got a penalty at Newcastle, uh, uh, Southampton, Jason. Penalty to Newcastle. If if I tell Here you now. If um if penalty to Newcastle if um if McCarthy saves this I am done. Come on McCarthy. <laughs> VAR decision right okay. Yeah who's going to be taking it Jason that's the question. Oh Fernandez yellow card. But it's been cancelled. Matt Ritchie. Matt Ritchie. Here we go. Come on, score. I want some crisps. I want some steak flavoured. Matt Ritchie, here we go. 44 minutes of the clock. The referee is getting the players out of the penalty area. Ritchie steps up. Still ushering players out of the box. <laughs> 
Here we go, whistle blows. It's saved! Alex, Mc Alex McCarthy saved it. <sighs> Jason, that is ridiculous. But we've got a goal at Sheffield United. <laughs> Who cares about Sheffield United? Who's going to have the goal scorer? Loads of people got. I mean, loads of people have got McCarthy. Loads. That is really oh, someone's, good. Someone's behind the screen. So I can't eat these blasted crisps. Say again. I can't eat these crisps. <laughs> uh, don't worry, I played Nick Pope ahead of Henderson. <laughs> Only because I wanted to have a bit of entertainment for tonight's uh, match. McCarthy. Alex that McCarthy, 4.5 <laughs> goalkeeper. Ah, right. He's been... How's Andy fire. 10 minutes behind? Andy, you're 10 minutes behind, mate. Stop spamming. <laughs> no way did Lundstrom get another assist. No, 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 no. He's 10 minutes behind. Oh, I was going to write, okay, fair enough. He's already had six saves, apparently, McCarthy. Yeah, he's... He's, due, he's, he's going to have a massive, massive haul if they keep a clean sheet as well. Bloody hell, man. That's crazy. <laughs> you know, I know Nick Pope may save from... Penalties save from... Who, who takes penalties now for Tottenham? There's, there's so many players out at the moment. Bergwin? Yeah. Well, that's McCarthy's now on 11 points. <laughs> Jason, have a look at this from Dre Zera. <laughs> For goodness sake. Oh, oh. Hang on. Oh, and Ketty's been taken down. No oh, penalty. it's not a penalty. Dre Zera with a six pound super chat. <laughs> what the hell? Hey, Dre Zera, you can get six packs Chris of Chris for that. And in team screenshots, have a look if you wish. So this is Dre's crisps. Getting some, <laughs> getting some air time at the moment. What did he get? <laughs> what did Dre Zera get? I need to look at this. Oh, oh, he's got a multi. He's got a multi a bag, multi pack. Ah. Half time whistle's blown. Sayes has just got a yellow. Ah. Apparently, don't don't quote me on that. That's, that's Nasu. We're calling you out. <laughs> I hope Bloody hell, I just realised we're at half time, Jason. We've had two goals. I'm, I'm hoping he's trolling. Let's find out. <laughs> Let's find out. Well, I can easily do it on my phone. It'd be quicker. It'd be actually quicker doing it on my phone than it would be on my laptop. <laughs> uh, Jason, I think it may be a good idea for you to do some admin. You're very good at admin. Uh, well, we've got the half time... Um, what do you recall? Yeah, of time course. Of Welcome to the uh, the FPO, FP, FPL uh, live stream, guys. We're live so soccer, FPL soccer Saturday, whatever you want to call it. Saturday, FPL Saturday live. Saturday, FPL live. Um, <laughs> thank you. If you're new here, please hit the uh, like and subscribe button for, for more content. And join our Discord. More importantly, every now and again, you will see the Discord link in the chat. Come and be a part of our Discord community. Talk to other like-minded FPL managers. Talk to us on air. And uh, yeah, post screenshots of your team, uh, have some discussion about everything, really. Um, I think the guys were in there till like gone three in the morning the other, yeah, the other day, talking uh, just about random stuff, not always about football, of course. So yeah, um, and uh, follow us on uh, Twitter and Instagram, uh, at Elite FPL. Absolutely, just yeah, to so, run. Yeah, he's got it. So he's got a yellow card, great. Yeah, That's yeah. Amazing. yeah. Absolutely freaking amazing. And just to quickly run through what's going on in today's games, you pretty much know, but earlier on, Liverpool beat Bournemouth 2 1. Salah and Mane with the goals, Van Dyke and Mane with the assists, and it was Callum Wilson getting the goal for Bournemouth and Lerma with the assist. It looks like Mane three bonus, Salah two, 
and Van Dijk getting one. Currently, is Arsenal nil, West Ham nil. Is there any save points for Jason? The answer is no. However, he has made two saves so far. Crystal Palace one, Watford nil. A with the goal, McCarthy with the assist. Uh, Sheffield United one nil. Uh, Billy Sharp with the goal, getting his second goal in the space of a week with Lundstrom assisting, and it's nil nil between Southampton and Newcastle. However. McCarthy has saved a penalty. He's already on six saves. So at the moment, he's on an extremely high score. And, 11, and it's Wolves nil. 11 points. Wow. Yeah, moment, yeah. Wolves nil. Brighton nil. It's been an absolute dire, dire uh, first two, half. Two sets, Steve Oates. Got to go and blow my nose. It's been a dire, uh, what you may call it, half so far. Uh, if anybody doesn't know, essentially, if a goal goes in, I will be eating a packet of McCoy's crisps. If anybody's uh, listening from McCoy's and would like to sponsor the show, then, uh, well, I'm, a, I'm an advocate of your crisps. So, you know, I'll be more than happy to eat more of your crisps live on air. Um, not only do I have the steak flavour, I also have the salt and vinegar flavour and also my favourite... And I say that again, favourite flavour, which is, if I can get it out of the bag, cheese and onion. So please, if anybody from McCoy's is a fan of fantasy football and would like to sponsor this show uh, and send us some samples to myself and Jason, please do. And if any other companies out there want to sponsor... No, I'm just taking the piss now. And... <laughs> yeah, it's, it's, it's been a dire... Um, are, you there, are you back with us, Jason? No, uh, it has been an absolute terrible, terrible uh, game week so far. Nothing has really happened. I'm not going to lie; it, it's been pretty disappointing. Uh, for anybody that does, for anybody that doesn't know, I've um, Captain Sterling and Jason. Remind us who you captain for this particular game week. Aubameyang. Aubameyang. So, two differentials from uh, two individuals. And tonight, if nobody doesn't know. I will be covering the Burnley versus Tottenham game. Uh, a lot of people, Jason, are thinking that Burnley could win. Um, really? Yeah, they are. They I, really I, I, are. I think possibly a draw, uh, maybe even goalless. I, I think that Burnley um, could easily frustrate Tottenham's, especially with Tottenham's lack of attacking options at the moment. Um. I think, I think, yeah, I think it's it's got upset written on it, written on the on that fixture with the way that uh, things have been panning out. Would it be an upset though? <sighs> well, for 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 a, a club as size of Tottenham, um, looking to you know try and reach the top four, yes, um, but for realistic speaking on form, probably not. No, no, exactly. But uh, the way we 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 always capitulate against these um, these teams, so I expect that Tottenham are going to probably end up when I said two one in my predictions. I think that Tottenham are probably going to edge this personally. But based on like you've just mentioned, form, the way Mourinho's setting up at the moment, we have got to. If we go at them, Jason, I think we're going to do them. But I don't think. Dice is going to allow that, and I think that it's going to end up as a, a bit of a drab game. Um, Matty T, good day, lads. Close to 2 a.m. here. Hope everyone is having a better game week than me. It's only been half time, and to be honest with you, Matty T, the game week isn't over until next week, Wednesday. Uh, in fact, talking of which, Jason, um, are we... Well, I, I can, but are you able to cover the, along with myself, the Man City game against Arsenal? Um... Wednesday evening. I don't see why not. Don't see why not. Uh, anything that Excellent. changes, I'll let you know. Uh, Bilal, yes, that is the answer. I took out Sterling for Marne. Uh, sorry, Marne for Sterling. But if I'd have taken out Salah for Sterling, uh, Salah would have got the goal and assist. So it really doesn't uh, uh, matter. Uh, Arioki in the last five game weeks, Burnley a third in points. Burnley are in form. Yeah, but we, like I said, when it comes to playing. Uh, these top six, traditional top six teams, we do absolutely terribly. We just seem to, I don't know, just seem to be a shadow of ourselves, to be honest with you. Uh, Matty T, Pepe, Pepe, captain, is still in play. Did you copy a certain FPL influencer, Matty T? Uh, 
Uh, here's a question. Well, it's not quite a question, Jason, but I will turn it into one. Uh, Shano83, another 45 minutes of hiding behind the couch in fear of a Bamiyang hauling. Do you think that will happen, Jason? Um, each minute that goes by adds more doubt in my mind, but I think that Aubameyang can get something, yes. I'm a, I, either a goal or an assist, I, I believe he will do something. Uh, Lama, if you're going to do a stream Monday evening regarding the, Ast- the Leicester versus Aston Villa game, do it, because I don't really want to um, waste my time. I don't, I don't want to cover that game. I, I just can't be bothered with it. It has no interest in me whatsoever. So, um, <laughs> Trey Sarah has tweeted McCoy's. <laughs> he tweets to everyone. Yeah. <laughs> but he, as he found out last night, he got. You should be careful. Who you tweet to. Because they might. Why just is that? Because they might just tweet back. But uh, uh, in a good way or a bad way. Well. It's, it's come on. Let's have the EFL drama. Come have, on. Let's. You have to ask Dre. Or yeah, get Dre to come oh, on here. Dre, if he had, if that's uh, another involved pro- Aussie boy as well, I think. I'm Paulie. Oh, interesting. Lads, you're going to have to perk up. The Discord waiting room is open. Like I said, if anybody wants to um, come live on air and be a correspondent from these matches, uh, people from Australia, people from Australia, if you want to be a, a correspondent, if you're watching any of the games live, then please just join myself and Jason because the stuff of Jason can only go on what the radio is doing. Jason's listened to one broadcast, I'm listening to another. And as you saw earlier on or heard earlier on, Basically, uh, we, we were at different games at the time, essentially. So, But no, I'm interested in this gossip, Jason, if neither of them are willing uh, to come no, up. There's no, no real gossip, mate. Ah, oh, what a shame. Sorry, mate. Uh, Get back to your crisps. <laughs> I, I can't, mate. I'm not allowed to eat them until a, go- a goal goes in. It kind of takes away from the... the, the um, <laughs> Enjoy <novelty. laughs> uh, Second half kicked off yet? Yeah? A block FBL, that's a good point. He's here now. Block, did you captain Doherty in the end? I'm going to find out because he's doing so good. He's, he, hasn't he flown up, Jason? I know I keep asking, saying this to you, but has a block FBL not only done well he's in going, our... He's going in the right direction, definitely. Um... He dropped a bit last week, but I don't think that really matters. Where's he gone in the Cash Mini League? Block, where have you gone in the Cash Mini League? You can't have dropped that seventh. far. Oh, is he? It's up to seventh. He, be- he plays bench Oh, piece. yes. Played his bench boost. Oh, oh my God! Guess yeah. what? He's got McCarthy on the bench. Oh, it's just, just absolutely ridiculous. Man, uh, and he's got—he has got Doherty captain. He did it. Well done, pal. Well done. And he's got Leno. Yeah. Wow. Uh, bench, bench boost. He's got Ings, and Perez, and McCarthy. And McCarthy there is going to return him probably seventeen points at this rate. What's this? A Ted Mawanki. Juggernaut's bench boosted with Mares captain and McCarthy in goal. Wow, let's have a look at this. Let's have a look, lads. All right, lads. <laughs> if anybody who knows who that is an impression of, um, I doubt it. Oh, 27 but... bench boost played. Wow. He's got lunch. Oh, hang on, why is lunch on one point? It's on four. Oh, right, okay. It looked really weird. <laughs> No, but I was wondering, yeah, on my screen, on my second monitor, like he was on one, then Oh, Bellerin didn't start for him. Ouch. It's a bit of a pain. But the fact he's got McCarthy, well done. I'm surprised he bench boosted, though, with those four. What do you think of that, seriously? Those four particular players, I wouldn't have bench yeah. boosted with them four. No. Not for me. But then... You just never know when, when you feel the time is right. The time is right, but I just think that um, in the fixtures that, like you said, the fixtures weren't exactly juicy this week. Um, I, I'd, oh be, I'd be doing it in a double game week where I can have a playing bench playing two two times. Uh, Jason, I suggest you look at second, Andrew Fong. I suggest you look at his team, my friend. <laughs> right. Okay. In, in, enjoy, enjoy. Triple captain. And Aubameyang. <laughs> nice. Oh, my life. Andrew Fong. <coughs> wow. <laughs> He's going to be nervous. <laughs> um, he 
he's got Roberts in there as well. He's got, he's got Grealish coming on for uh, for for Robertson. That's what I'm going to check out, Jason. The Champions League. I want to see who my opponent is because there's a tiny. It's unlikely I'm going to get through, but there's a tiny chance that I could actually make. It's a very small chance, but it's very very unlikely. I'd have to win both my matches. What about? Do you know who you're playing at all? I have a quick look myself. But what a fantastic pod, wasn't it, Jason, that him and Daily Lama and Firetog did? Oh, yeah. Going, going through them all and um, you know, to find out how, how they got all the database working as well. It's yeah. amazing. I'm going to check it out now. So oh, I am up against Game Week 29. I'm up against Kieran Hanna and he did a minus four. Keyboy. Oh, Keyboy. I mean, he's somebody that I just... I don't hear about anymore. And I'm up against... Oh, we both took a minus four. Kaiser Heighton. So Keyboy is currently on... 17 points, minus four. He's Captain Pepe. Has he really? He's, cap he's, he's Captain Pepe, yeah. <sighs> nice. Um, he's got Ryan in goal as well. Uh, Boone is saying, have a look at his, his team, but he's got McCarthy, hasn't he? It's not really... Just, just saying a humble brag. Yeah, it's a humble brag. Is that all it is? It's just, it's just McCarthy, isn't it? No, I, um, I, I'll quickly have a look at his team. Hang on. Have a look. See, see if he's... Um, right, the, the games are kicking off, everybody. Hopefully we'll have more goals. Hopefully I'll get through... Uh, 22 packs of delicious McCoy's flavoured Ridge Cut Crisps. And, uh, yeah, we're all kicking off. Hopefully we have a lot of goals. McCarthy in goal, Sice, Doherty, Alexander-Arnold, Pepe, Mane, Salah. Oh, God. What what a good game week he's going to have. All right, radio's back on. Nothing's loading up, typical. Uh, so Hill, yes, every time I eat a packet of Chris, uh, sorry, every time a goal goes in, I eat a packet of Chris to the annoyance of everybody. We've got around 100 people watching this, everybody. If you are enjoying this, just simply hit the like button right now. Um, let's get this up in the algorithm. How much? 152. Is there really 152 of you yep. watching me and Chris and Jason with a cold? It's not good, is it, Jason? <laughs> <laughs> Are you excited for the second half, Jason? Um, nervous a little bit because I my um minus eight is looming, and I think at this rate I'm going to be approaching the uh, 250,000. Mark, as opposed to approaching the one hundred thousand mark. Every time you eat a crisp, someone scores. <laughs> it's so annoying that I can't. Well, I say I can't. I can if I wanted to. It would have been easier if I just had a tin of tuna every time for this this particular thing. Hey, uh, Jerry, thank you so much. Well, talking of your birthday, Jason, in answer to Sir Hill's question, yeah, basically, I was going to buy a birthday cake for Jason, but from a selfish point of view, um, every time a goal went in, I'd eat a slice of cake on Jason's behalf. But unfortunately, well, bizarrely, someone offered me birthday cake this morning, so I just had that, and I thought, oh, I don't really want to be eating too much cake uh, today because I don't want them, especially based on what I was talking about the other day on my uh, McDonald's stream. A lot of birthday messages for you, Jason. Yeah, it's birthday. Thanks, it's Jason's birthday, everybody. Send him some money. <laughs> what was it? Your, your, your nan and your aunt would send him a fiver and a birthday card? Yeah. Stick it in. Stick it in. <laughs> um, Hiroki says, wow, Wolves medical staff is amazing. The coach made the players warm up for three minutes before taking the, taking the pitch again. Really? Three minute warm up before getting back on the field. Pepe's been fouled. Oh, no, he hasn't. Referee's told him to get back up. Apparently he went down too easily. Well, why not give him the yellow card then? 
<laughs> Old man, Bang. yeah, I know. I, I'm, I've got a stinking cold at the moment as well. I feel like oh, I'm going to blow Buda, my nose really? in five minutes. Cantwell's been subbed at half time. Ouch. <laughs> for, wow. <laughs> Paulie, a man in form when it comes to his bets. Paulie, for every goal one of my FPL players scores in the second half, I'll donate five pounds to the channel. Are your players playing today, Paulie? <laughs> I was waiting for that. I was waiting for someone to say that in chat. Yeah, 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 yeah. A bit, a bit of a bleak joke there. I really did enjoy your conversation actually about that particular. I, I think it's gonna, I think it's coming. Right, I, I've, I've um. What, listen to an interesting um, interview with uh, a vaccine doctor that does like vaccines and stuff around the world and he was saying that we're like 18 months away from a vaccine um, and that we're, we're, we're no, this is the tip that we've not even reached um, anywhere near the, the final peak of the, of the actual um, no. break yet so Almost, and it's cool. yeah, it's quite uh, quite doom and gloom on the news, but I think um, I think for the majority of people that have got healthy immune systems, you've not got a lot to worry about. But for the people that have, if you've got loved ones that have got compromised immune systems or suffering from uh, uh, a certain disease or uh, underlying health issues, then that's where the real issues start to come. So, so we should all take it seriously and wash your hands. I, um, Absolutely. Yeah, wash your hands, guys, and don't shake the hands of people. You you know, just do the do the. Uh, the have you heard of the coronavirus handshake? It's like you um, you use your elbow. I'm being serious. You use your elbow and you just like do that. Sorry. You use your elbow <laughs> and touch someone else's elbow instead of using your hands. Now, honestly, it's 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 a lot more hygienic. Uh, uh, Shano, in answer to your question, toilet, pe toilet paper issues in shops over there. Uh, seen as I work in retail, the simple answer is yes. It's hilarious. Um, in fact, just to make everybody laugh, essentially people are panic buying toilet rolls, antibacterial, yeah, anything yeah. to do with antibacterial, and also berries. <laughs> berries. I'm assuming berries contain some form of nutrient which prevents diseases <laughs> for goodness sake <clears throat> hopefully we get some goals Jason let's, and let's come on pray to the FPL gods Jason <laughs> you're normally very good with that I'm praying please pray, I'm praying to the FPL gods right now come on come on lads Jason Only three more in. wins away as well, Jason, for Liverpool. Three more wins. Yeah. When they when they conceded after like eight minutes, do you think here we go again? Um, I did actually. Yeah, I thought, come on. Um, I don't. I would have loved it if they dropped points. <laughs> what do you think about the game against Atletico Madrid? I generally think they may win it, but like two one, and they get knocked out by away goals. I think they got a chance of going through. Yeah, it's the fact that it's Anfield, isn't it? I think it's just they're conceding such sloppy goals at the moment. They are, yeah. yeah. And Adrian, obviously, Allison's going to be out. So for every goal my captain Danny Ing scores, yeah. I'll donate nine pounds, baby. That's one. That's one donation Steve doesn't want to be getting. No, no, Jason, I do because it's four pound fifty. <laughs> Sorry, minus thirty well, no. forty cent. That's yeah, what. Yeah, yeah. Uh, Three pound fifty. No, it's less than that. Anyway. <laughs> Sorry. Two pound seventy. Uh, Jason, you're good with technology. Go on, Can you please bring up Dre Zera's tweet that he sent to McCoy's? This is this is actually really funny. Right, Dre we... Zera, that's right, very very we... funny indeed. Um. Dre Zera, very, very clever. Hello, McCoys. Oh, hang on, hang on. Read it out in three, two, one. 
Get up on the screen. You've got to get up on the screen. Go on, go on. Have you got up on the screen? Yeah, yeah, yeah. Hello, McCoys. I would like to say that Elite, F- <laughs> Elite Steve, Steve and Jason 100% supports your excellent product and would be open to discussing a sponsorship deal for Elite FPL YouTube channel. Steve? Who's Steve? Steve-O has been digging into your lovely crinkle bliss. <laughs> At least put up a beautiful... That picture is ridiculous. <laughs> You got my arms in there. That's the main thing. My arms are in there. <laughs> By the way, Jason, this is supposed to be an extra large shirt, and it's like a flaming large. <laughs> yeah, it doesn't. Um... It's got your muscles are too big. That's what it is. No, it's not. It's the f- no. Next time I get a shirt, it needs to be a two XL. A double XL. <laughs> needs to be a double. Yeah. <laughs> Why is it? What is it? The length? Because. The length, yeah, it's so short on me. <coughs> Not that that's I know. Weird, that's weird because on mine, it's past. It comes right down to um, well, underneath my pockets. <laughs> yeah, but I've got like fifteen foot legs. <laughs> yeah, well, it's just because you've got an ob- ob- normal body shape doesn't mean that, uh, that their sizing's incorrect. I've got the um, stereotypical women's <laughs> model look. I've got really long legs, a really short torso. Just I'm like an orangutan. I'm like an orangutan. Just long yeah. arms and long, long legs. Sasquatch. <laughs> yeah, exactly. Oh, bloody hell. Poor Mansell. Eating crisps is the new tearing up betting slips. <laughs> Do you know how funny that is? When I hear the betting slips being ripped up. <laughs> Very amusing. Uh, gee whiz, some were even confident that they bet me Arsenal would score three all past us. Thankfully, I wasn't that person. <laughs> yeah, exactly, Christoph. Two goals in 15 minutes. You did, mate, you don't have to stream this. <laughs> it's difficult, isn't it, Jason? I'm Bowen, <laughs> Cresswell, uh, headed away. Uh. David Louise headed it away. Uh, Arsenal now on the break. Comes to nothing. Apparently Arsenal nearly took the lead. To do with Saka, of course, and then Ketia, brilliant. Come so, on, Saka. What is going on? This Enketia though, 4.5 million. 4.3. 4.3 million. And do you know what? I actually did as a draft... Well, as a transfer, I was going to see if I could get him in with Sterling, but unfortunately, I couldn't afford him. I was 0.6 out of that. Uh, well, he hadn't done anything anyway, so... Damn, Saka could have got something. Blast! It's a Cora, <sighs> got a yellow card. Nah. What's going on, guys? Where are all the goals gone? It's all dry. Well, it's, us, it's us. Ever since we decided to start streaming 3 p.m. kickoffs during 3 p.m. <laughs> that's it. We jinxed everything. <clears throat> Very frustrating. Are you doing anything for your birthday, Jason, apart from bowling, going out for a meal or anything, or is it just a case well, of we had, no? We had bowling and lunch. And... We had bowling and lunch today. And... What did you have for lunch? Oh, a to- oh, Leno with an amazing save. Wow. Wow. Yeah, I had um I had a burger. I had a um vegetable burger. A what, sorry? A vegetable burger. Oh, right, okay. Yeah. Have you tried the Vegetable Burger King burger? The, oh, I can't no, remember what I it's called. No. It's rubbish. Absolute junk. Uh, uh, Jason, do you want to remind people about fake news? Because I do like it when you do give out the old uh, uh, please right. do uh, somebody, morning. Somebody, somebody on Planet Zog found out about a goal that no one else knew about. No, I'm, I'm assuming that it was dealt with. Yeah, 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 it's been dealt with. Yeah, I'm just saying. Would you like to just tell uh, all the audience if anybody's yeah, listening? So basically, <laughs> basically, 
anyone that <laughs> screams out goals or um, such as well, so like goals or assists uh, that are true, or, well, not true, uh, they're completely fabricated, will be uh, dealt with by one of our moderators in the chat. So easy, easy, uh, easy way to put it. If you don't want to be able to talk in the chat, just scream some fake goals out. Yeah. <laughs> Fill your boots. Yeah, we do appreciate all the moderators. Uh, oh, taking Chelsea less time. Flyer getting timed out. Yeah. <laughs> well, unfortunately, apparently Arsenal are not convincing Jason. <sighs> um, what can I say, mate? I mean, I'm not watching the game, but it sounds like it's pretty dull. <laughs> I come back and it looks like the chat's become spicy. Mr. Blue Nathan, this is what happens when there's nothing going on in the games. People like to make up a bit of drama and say um, silly things. Um, FIFA trader Brown says he's bench, boost with, he's bench boosted with Mane captain on 49 right now. Well, well done to you. Give him, everyone a clap. Whereabouts are you in the overall rankings, FIFA trader? Um, Leno saves as Nick Patel. I, I'd be happy to get um, a clean sheet. And a couple of save points would be awesome. Um, <clears throat> Bamiang's playing left wing back. What? Yeah. He's playing on the left. Did you not know this? Or? Left wing back. Not left wing back, is he? No, yeah, yeah, I mean, that's yeah. a bit dramatic, yeah. but he's, he's playing on the left. Because obviously uh, when Saka bombs forward, I think Bamiang pushes a bit back, I think. Um, 137,000 that's that's good it's going in the right direction that's excellent that's very very good and Ketty is coming off it looks like oh really for Lacazette I'm assuming Lacazette will come on Francis Logan 1-0 to Sp Burnley I'll take that now will, will we go above them I think I'll do that in the stream for anybody that's not who's watching it so the, hundred, the 165 people hold on a minute Boone you said we win 3-0 uh, oh, well, well, okay, well, we're waiting for some goals to come in. Now, it, it could not have been a better time to hit that like button. What, what are you doing? The, um, the, the, uh, the Do some admin, Jason. I'm going to go for a quick... Uh, uh, I'm going to use the facilities. I'll be back in a few oh, seconds. Know. Hit the subscribe button, guys, <laughs> if you're not already subscribed to the channel. Hit the like button and uh, check us out on Twitter and uh, Instagram. And be, be a member of our Discord as well while you're at it. Whilst we've all got this time in our hands, we might as well do it now. Um, subbed before 60 minutes, you love to see it. And Ketty, yeah, one pointer. Uh, that's savage. Did anyone really have him in? Someone score. I don't care if my defender loses his clean sheet. I know it's really, really poor at the moment in terms of goals. How long have I had Aurier? I've had him since like game week. I want to say like game week 17, but probably a slight exaggeration there. I'll find out when I brought him in. Game week 16. I brought him in game week 16. Aurier in. There we go, wasn't that far off? <clears throat> Praying for a Wolves clean sheet with Bolly and Patricio with McCarthy also doing a job on nine points. Very, very good uh, owning McCarthy this game week. Very, very good. <laughs> What is going on? What is... Arsenal are just not doing anything. Fair play to G Wiz. He seemed to say that Arsenal wouldn't um, punish West Ham in this fixture. Hello, uh, Dre Zero. How you doing? I'm all good, guys. Can you guys hear me? Here is Mr. McCoy's. Good I can, afternoon. I can hear you, mate. Have you um, got a response from uh, McCoy's yet? Or... I haven't got a response yet, but. If we get a response from McCoy's in the stream, you'll hear it here first, only on oh, Elite FBS. Sorry, do you know who Mr. Beast is, Jason? Yeah, I do. 
Right. Uh, for anybody that doesn't know who Mr. Beast is, essentially he's one of the most successful YouTubers on the planet. But anyway, if if you tweet him and tag a live stream during um, the show, there's a chance he may donate $10,000. So if anybody wants to tweet... You better buy us a, a nearly uh, FPL studio that we can... At, yeah. At Mr. Beast. I'm going to do it now, Jason, while I can. I may as well... Get a that's, bit of that's um... the plan, guys. That's the plan. We're gonna we're gonna build a studio. We're gonna rent some office let um, rent some office space out. We're gonna have an elite FPL studio with a nice elite FPL set with tables. And Steve is gonna be one side. I'll be on the other side. That is the that is the future plan of elite FPL, guys. That is the future plan. I'll, t- I'll tell you what the future plan for me is. In all seriousness, exactly what you just said. But like how True Geordie does it, their setup is perfect. Apparently, Ings has speared Dubravka. <laughs> is he going to get a yellow card then? We don't want to hear that negativity, mate. Oh, it's your captain, isn't he? Sure he, is. Steve obviously didn't think much of him. Put him on the bench. <laughs> <laughs> Why did you captain him, Dre? You see. I just have this innate belief that he's going to do something amazing, especially since in the last game he was used sparingly. He came off the bench. He's fresh. He's ready to go against a team like Newcastle that's uh, got a terrible away record. However, they're down to 10 men, so uh, it's a bit uh, squeaky bum time, to be honest. Well, we've got, what, 30 minutes left, 35 minutes left, so... There can't be that many G-Wiz captaining Ings. How many people do you know who's captaining Ings, uh, G- Drazer? Uh, I think I'm the only one, to be honest. Yeah. If um, the Don says in chat, if Ings doesn't score today, he's done with him. Would you be getting rid of Ings if he doesn't do anything this uh, game week? And the same for you, Stevie? Oh, yeah. I was... Um... Oh, who was I going to... I was going to get Giroud, wasn't I? In fact, I now wish I'd just got a Giroud and for um, Ings, to be honest with you. Oh, no. Traore's coming on. And apparently, according to Paul Mansell, could be on for uh, Jimenez. Oh, for God's sake. <laughs> Why do you wow. have a... Yep, Jimenez oh, is off. Oh, <laughs> <laughs> <sighs> Wait a minute. Hold on a minute. What's going on? Apparently it's Neves. What's going on here, everybody? Trail room for Neves. Right. Right. I was going to say that was a really weird yeah. substitution. I would have done that, yeah. Jesus. Right, ban him. Ban him. <laughs> cheerio, cheerio, cheerio. See, this is why we don't get... Fake goal shouts. <clears throat> my my blood pressure. God, I'll tell you now. So, Trezor, your thoughts on the game week so far? Uh, mainly the Liverpool game earlier on. You cut out halfway if you're asking me a question. I was asking Trezor, but if you're here, Paulie, I got brought in halfway. I brought, I brought him in. I, I saw him waiting there, like. Oh, oh, sorry. Uh, are you talking about whether if Inga's blanked, uh, should I get rid of him? Was that the question? We asked that 30 minutes ago. If you want to answer it now, then please do. <laughs> I'll keep him. I have faith. Sorry, I'm just eating McCauley's. My apologies. Aubameyang just fired in across and Pepe just didn't make the most of it. Oh, it's going to be one of those games, isn't it? Oh, what is going on? All these Chris VAR aboard. check. Hang on, hang on. VAR huh? check. Hang on. Possible penalty. It wasn't given. Right. Okay. It would have been for Arsenal. Yeah. A foul on Pepe, apparently. Mm. But um, it hasn't been given, so we don't need to no. worry about that. No. No penalty. <sighs> I tell you what, there's been hardly any goals at all. It's just been, it's just been boring, isn't it? 
Right. In terms of in terms of the games, they sound very drab. Yeah. <laughs> McCarthy's on sixteen points. Six. Somebody wipe oh, that. Good. Somebody wipe that clean sheet, please. Somebody. Who who scores for Newcastle? Nobody. Saint Maximin. Uh, Vish, you're not the only one. Hey, a man. Is that a man, Dylan? Is, Hello, yeah. my favourite people. <laughs> you won't Ender be liking Steve, today, mate. Ender Stevens has been subbed with a clean sheet. Nice, nice, nice. Clean sheet locked. <laughs> people posting scores of sixty-six. I'm thinking. You know what? That's a very good point by Mister Blue Nathan. Normally, these food challenges where we eat a goal, a, eat something for goals, normally produce goals galore. But this has been so far. Remember that time when I had donuts. Yes, I do, and yeah. I, had about, I must have had about 15, 16 donuts, and I, was, uh, I had to stop in the end. <laughs> would you do it again? No. I would. Uh, if anybody's willing to donate, how much are those? Uh, let's, uh, oops. let's find out how much those donuts are from that uh, specialist shop raise there. I'll zoom in, and I think they're like, they do like deals like. <coughs> I think they're like five, six pound a donut, but if you buy like a bulk, it's like it's a bit like Krispy Kremes. It's like if you buy in bulk, they um, do a decent offer. So, if anybody's willing to donate twelve quid, I'll buy a, a giant. <laughs> I'm joking, everybody. Where is it? I almost pressed the donation button there, Stephen. Dele- what the? In fact, you know what? Tell us about uh, what you were doing the other day, Dre, while we're doing nothing, while there's nothing on happening. Uh, are you talking about the Twitter thing from last night? No, 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 no. Your music video. Oh, yeah. So Wednesday, uh, during uh, eight hours of filming, I'm filming a music video, my first ever music video, in an abandoned uh, airbase. Uh, that has been about us since 1987 and yeah uh, the music video should drop in about 40 by 14 for 50 for March that kind of time and uh, I'll do a premiere for it so you'll know ahead of time when it's out I, d- I did notice the Mad Ting graffiti did you notice that Drazo? I was the one that took the picture and <laughs> I saw it and I was so proud of whoever did that that looks like it's been there for many many years so uh, yeah, yeah. probably uh, some of them may have heard me many years ago and uh, this is your band I'm a solo artist however right. I'll collaborate with different artists uh, to create the music What's if that makes well we've got some news that uh, Pepe has been subbed off Apparently Pepe has been subbed off, everybody. Thank you, Firetog, for that. And uh, Jerry Swanee saying, what a waste that was. <laughs> um, Jerry saying, I bench McCarthy. <laughs> Paulie, your thoughts on the, the game between Liverpool and uh, Bournemouth? Uh, the first about 10-15 minute, Bournemouth were the better team and Liverpool just didn't seem to have it together. Uh, then they slowly came into the game and then when they took the lead, uh, Bournemouth were still getting the chances, but Liverpool, I think, should have scored more than what they did today. Saying that, Bournemouth could have had more than one as well. Mm. Mm. Are they going to go down? Um, it, it'll be close. I think between them and Brighton, I think. Are you able to come on this evening for the Burnley game? Cover it? Uh, yeah, I'll be able to come on. Fantastic. There we are. There's our correspondent for this evening. By the way, if anybody else wants to uh, uh, come on live tonight to discuss all things, um, well, anything really during the Burnley versus Tottenham game, you're more than welcome to. Like I said, I'm going to be covering that this evening. Thank you, Dre. Uh, sorry, Dre. Uh, G Wiz for that. Um, a gold trick off for Billy Sharp. And yes, just to clarify, Reese Nelson is on for Pepe. Gee whiz has cursed this, this game week. He told me that I shouldn't be banking on Aubameyang getting a, a hat-trick at home. 
to West Ham. What did he know that I didn't? Yeah. <laughs> uh, uh. Ignore the fake goals. Oh, well, thank you, Matty T. Uh, Jason, do you want to read out Matty T's super chat? Uh, who's your next transfer if you had to make one? Um, oh, I... Sorry, Jason, can I, can I go first? Yeah. Mane! But I can't afford him. <laughs> uh, uh, I think... Calvert Lewin would be going for me, um, and pop maybe Chris Wood. Why Chris Wood? I heard you mention him yesterday. Why? He's, he's all right. He's placing he gave, plays in game week thirty one. I'm trying. I I need to get players that are playing in game week thirty one. So maybe Callum Wilson. I think Bournemouth could be a team to target because they're actually, to be fair, on form, scoring-wise. Oh no, they're, they're away. Right, so I've got up in front maybe of me at the Deeney, moment. Maybe Deeney. I think yeah, that think... Burnley Watford game's got like one a one nil win for either team. Oh yeah, yeah, yeah. Um, yeah. Two, two one either way, something like that. I don't really know. Oh, Chris Wood starts today. Talking to Chris Wood. Of course he does. He'll score as well. He's... Well, hold on a minute. I'll be able to reveal the Tottenham team news. Oh. Leno is apparently on bonus three. <laughs> Fantastic. Tottenham have made five changes. Is all Ari, playing? That's Ari, the main Ari, thing. Ari's on bench. Oh, for really? Really? Yeah. yeah. Ariz, Panganga, Sanchez, Dyer, Alderweireld, Vertonghen, Skip, and Dombele, Lamella, Deli, Ali, Bergwin, Gazaniga, Aria, Sessegnon, Winks, Lacelso, Fernandez, and Lucas Moura on bench. Uh, Jason, how's the cup? <laughs> Did it take a dive. When? Uh, when... <laughs> My, my radio is attached to me, right? And when I freak out like that, it, it takes a it takes a bit of a battering. <laughs> oh. If you think this is bad, you should see me when I play FIFA. <laughs> I mean, all I'm hearing is... Well, no, I'm not even hearing that. Right. Very many Absolutely goals. Great. What a, what a great birthday present. Thank you ever so much, Jose Mourinho. Jot has gone off. Oh, Steve, I punch a hole through the wall. Go on. Ah, don't bother me. <laughs> Sterling, mate. Sterling's going to be the one. Yeah, I said the same about Abamye. Come on, Danny Ings. Where, the, where are the goals? We, we are supposed to be covering the goals and assists as they go and everybody, but unfortunately, there's just absolutely nothing. And uh, Jason, you are right. Leno is going to be on three bonus points, although he's closely followed by David oh, Luiz, Luiz. Mary Diop. It's ridiculous. Uh, <sighs> Lundstrom's on three bonus. Uh, oh, is he? Of course he is. Saiz is on free bonus. Saiz? He's got a yellow yeah. card? Yeah, he's on free at minute. What? <laughs> what? Ollie and Vinagre on two. <laughs> I'm sorry, that just blows my mind. That is Gaeta's on, yeah, Gaeta's gonna, Gaeta's on free as well. It's not going to stay like that. No way it's not going to stay on Saiz on bonus free. No way. I'm going to say this like David Brent to uh, Danondes. Uh, on the bad side, I have a shotter in Jimenez. On the positive, I just got nine bog rolls from Tesco and made it home with them. Congratulations. Did you hear that there was actually reports of people selling hand sanitizer for up to £120? Shit. I, I know that people were doing this, but... £120? Quid. Quid. Yeah, it was on Sky, get... Sky News. Someone in America was prosecuted for that. So... Yeah, it should be. 
I can't remember what the criminal act is, but um, specifically, but yes, it is. Station uh, probably. <clears throat> oh, I can't believe all he's bench. This is just getting worse. A G like saying him as a... Sorry, Drazer. I was just going to say I'd like to thank Boona uh, for giving me the tip just before uh, the game week started with Robertson uh, uh, not in the squad uh, to get Tanganga in. So I brought him in for the bench. So I'd just like to shout out. Thank you, Boona. Uh, I've got some two Tottenham assets. Yes, thank you. Uh, Vish, what's the formation for Spurs? It's a 5 it's a goal. Four, one. Disallowed. For who? For, 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 for Spurs. Oh, we're just talking about Spurs. Uh, Arsenal. Uh, Arsenal. Arsenal. It's been disallowed, has it? Been disallowed. Offside flag up. For who? who? Just VAR's interest... reviewing it now. It would have been luck of that goal. They are checking it. Ozil. So, so uh, Aubameyang had the initial shot, deflected, and then someone, I think Ozil, headed it. Oh, it was Lacazette. Yeah, uh, Ozil's passed it to Lacazette. All oh, right, so no, if nothing to do with Aubameyang. I oh, don't, don't care. Abdul, Abdul, you need a Pepe goal. Sorry, mate, he's been subbed off. <laughs> Sorry, mate. <laughs> oh, so funny. I can't eat Easter eggs, Dunnonas. Sorry, mate. Can't eat them. Just destroy the sugars for me. Just destroy my oh, teeth. They've got their lines out. Yeah, it's. Well, they're still doing like... VAR. It yeah. looks as though it's going to be 1 0. What? It's a goal, I think. Well, I'm still hearing it now on my headphones. Nothing's. They're Nothing's waiting. been still waiting. They're still waiting. Still waiting. People, stop saying it's a goal. It's not. They're just drawing the lines, everybody. <laughs> They're still waiting. They're still waiting. Apparently, it's Urzel assist. If um, if anything, but it's not going to get. Well, it could get given, but I doubt it. Why has it been taking so long? Yeah, it's it's, it's going to be a goal. Why is it taking so long? <laughs> the check in Urzil apparently from the uh, yeah. shot. Goal stands. There we go. That was a goal. Goodbye, my three One bonus nil. points from Leno. Yes. I need two crisps. Nice <laughs> job. Finally. Hmm. Mute me. <laughs> no, I, I love the sound of the Chris man. Keep on going. McCoy's need a hit. Hmm. Hmm. Cheers, everybody. Mm. Show me the morning. Well done. I know Saka was involved, but uh, go on, St. Mary's. I think Newcastle have scored. Newcastle have scored. St. Maxim. St. Maxim has scored. <laughs> I did, didn't I? Hooray! I said, move me. Move me. Mm. 
Did anyone know who assisted that Newcastle goal? So yeah, no clean sheet for him. Um... I need Wolves to score, and I need Watford to score. Come on. Norwich goal as well. I've got an idea. There's no assist for a Newcastle goal. You can mute your microphone, you know that, Steve. I'm taking it now. No, I can still hear you. How do you mute your mic? Press the button on your microphone. What, the big thing in the middle? Yeah. Hear me now? Yeah, I can hear you. Oh, hold on a minute. <laughs> so, Paulie, what game are you watching? I'm not. What was that? Not watching the game. He asked me what game I was watching. Uh, David P, you can uh, you can mention those of all you like, but as Boone said, unfortunately, he didn't go through with it. Uh, Gabriel, I said I want to Norwich goal, not the rest. Ke Kenneth M, sorry, mate, but uh, if you don't like it, clear off. What's your current points as it stands then, Paulie? 35. I think you finally discovered how to meet your mic, Steve. Shake your head if you, if you hear me. You know how to meet your mic. There we go. <laughs> yeah, people getting really annoyed. Oh, yeah, well, I think they're more annoyed. So, yeah, they, they're tuning in because they're expecting to, us to talk about goals, but unfortunately we haven't got that. Mm, mm, mm. Mm, that is delicious. Not good goals anyway, that's FPL-centric. I mean, the fact that Arsenal yeah. scored, I've got absolutely no interest in Ozil or Lacazette. And my captain has done absolutely nothing. Mm. <clears throat> Crystal Palace still in the Watford area. <laughs> Davy P. Carving up, Stephen. I wish I was, mate. But the, the, the FPL gods aren't allowing it. <laughs> Hopefully there'll be more entertainment in the Burnley game. Crazy. What's uh, the the I need Brighton and Norwich to score. I need Wolves and Watford to score. Okay, guys. What's the current bonus points for all the teams as it stands, guys? Uh, just Jason, to tell all the... Uh, as it stands at the moment, you've got... Um, apparently, Leno's still on bonus three. Um... We've got Lundstrom, so Lacazette on bonus two, Marriott and David Luiz on bonus one in the Arsenal. Leno's on three, Lacazette's on two, Marriott oh and God. David Luiz are, are on the, one. These guys need... Lundstrom's oh, on, on three, Billy Sharp's on two, Hang on, 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 hang on. I was, I was already reading them out, but I had myself muted, sorry. Ah. Oh. <laughs> sorry, 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 sorry. Um, so, Sheffield United and Lawrence, we've got Lundstrom on bonus three, Billy Sharp, bonus two, Bashup, Bashup, 
uh, bonus one. We've got McCarthy on bonus three uh, for Newcastle. Uh, St. Maximin, bonus two, and Fernandez bonus one. And for the Crystal Palace Watford game, we've got Gaeta and Ayu joint on bonus three, and Dan on bonus one. In the Brighton Wolves, Wolves Brighton game, Saiz still remains on minus three. I have no idea how or why. He must be having a good game. Vinagra on 29 uh, with bonus two. And Bolly on 28 with bonus one. <coughs> Sorry, Paulie. It's fine. Sorry, I muted, I muted myself, so you couldn't hear when I was already talking. Declan Rice. Ugh. This is such an anticlimax. How are your predictions going, Bilal is asking in chat. Rubbish. Absolutely pants. Let's um, remind myself of what I did. Uh, I said 2-0 Liverpool. I said 2-1 to Arsenal. Crystal Palace, I said Watford would win. Sheffield Norwich, I said 0-0. Southampton Newcastle, I went 1-0 Southampton. Wolves Brian, I said 2-1. <clears throat> She's gone free. <sighs> the, 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 the Don sums it up in, in five words. This game week is so bad. Yeah. Especially if you don't own Marnie. Yeah. <laughs> oh, Dean Henderson with another save against Jamal Lewis. Norwich apparently throwing the the whole lot at uh, Sheffield United at the moment. Gabriel De Rock, no one's going to like it. They're going to dislike it because uh, they hate me eating crisps. Can't be eating Chris. Sorry, Kenneth. <clears throat> it's such a shame, though. Like, whenever you do these streams, you expect it to be a right laugh, but it just gets... When there's just lack of talking points in these games or anything, it's just it's very, very difficult to... to... Um, to bring up conversation pieces. How many minutes are left? It's got to be like... That's five or six. Mm. Roughly five or six minutes. Wow. Uh, Vish, don't worry, they will not be getting a, a goal to Watford, that is. Bilal, this has been the most boring week of the season. Well, it's only, it's only, it's only just started. Uh, the most important uh, matches are still to come. Well, from an FPL perspective, be tomorrow United versus City, and obviously Everton away at Chelsea. A lot of assets from Everton, and then Leicester, Aston Villa, and of course Wednesday with Man City versus Arsenal. So it won't be uh, too bad. We're in injury time now, Steve. Yes, that's right. Yeah, yeah. Is it too early to talk about game week thirty, guys? Oh yeah. yeah. Well, it is for now. Yeah. <laughs> oh. So of course, Everton why versus I, Liverpool. Why did I Monday. In well. It's a logical decision. He could come up still with the question. <sighs> Does anybody know the answer to this? Denondes, which Premier League player in the history has the longest surname? I'm thinking of that Bolton player, Gianno Copolopoulos, or whatever his name is, Denondes. That's the only thing that I just instantly thought of. The Greek guy. Or, uh, yeah, Gianno Copolopoulos or Jaskalainen. Him that played for um, Norwich has got to be close, that. Ricky Van Wolf, Winkle, or whatever you want to call Oh, yeah. Surname, though, Van Wolf's Winkle. <clears throat> Again, Jerry, I wouldn't be saying that you're a dumbass for 
for captaining a Bamiang is a perfectly logical uh, Boona they are going to keep a clean sheet so well done you're in the top 10 of the cash mini league well done very good I just want to end this stream so I can um, eat a bit of food get some vegetables just praying a Bamiang does something in the dying embers of the game Let's refresh the B BAPS to see if there's any changes. That's his name. Thank you. Leno looks like he's going to be getting bonus three. You and your goalkeepers, Jason. I know. I've, they've, they've, they've paid off for me, my goalkeepers. Saïs is still on bonus three as well. That's ridiculous. I was thinking that, Bilal. The FPL gob didn't want Steve to overdose on Chris. I was actually thinking that. <laughs> <laughs> Trade, Sarah. Remind me. Jason. Yeah. There you are, pal. £4.50 from Trey Zera. I don't want Jason sad on his birthday, so here you go. Ah, oh, Trey Zera, man. Don't worry about it, man. I'm... I'm not. I, I'm not sad. I'm just not feeling very well. I'm a little bit uh, bunged up, and um, my captain hasn't uh, returned. So, it, you know. I've, but the good thing is, I've got a second chance. Um, We're all in the same boat, aren't we? Let's be honest. A second chance against uh, away at Man City you might be able to do something. You never know. Do you know that wouldn't surprise me, Jason, if Abamie actually does it against Man City but can't do it against West Ham. <laughs> yeah. Really wouldn't surprise me. Because I reckon that could be could be an open game, but. Of course, Arteta going back. Hmm. That's his name, James. Gianno Coppolopoulos. Yeah, that's his name. Thank you. Of course, Crystal Palace scoring that goal means my uh, my bench player, Cathcart, is on two points. Chef United's full-time. Oh, it's ended full-time. 1-0 one, one again. Yeah, I agree with Bilal. Leno pick from you, Jason Payne, off big time. Absolutely. Absolutely. And this summer has tweeted us saying, sorry, lads, I wasn't intentional fake news. Commentator on CNBC said that Jimenez was off for Traore. Um, Glasto Mongrel. At Glasto Mongrel. Well, um, full time at Wolf. Send, send me um, a PM on, on Twitter and we'll get you. Um, I don't know if you were banned or if you were just timed out. If you were timed out, you should be able to talk again now. If you've been banned, let me know and we'll sort it out. Yeah, send it nil-nil. Thank you, Paulie. Uh, Wolves versus Brighton, nil-nil. Wow. Quite out loud. Is that some sort of a kept-up uh, Vauxhall Nova, was it? What's that, sorry? Someone just went past. I don't know. Someone's window must be open or something. I just heard a. Maybe mine. But I can't hear anything. Past with a real aftermarket exhaust pipe. Oh, it's on the break at the yeah. moment. Five minutes almost up. About a... done. Absolutely nothing. He's not going to do anything. He said he doesn't look like he was interested when he received the ball. <laughs> Sais is just hanging on with those three points. I hope he does get them. And it's full time. Yeah. Full time. Wow. Hooray. Thank goodness. There we go, ladies and gentlemen. That has been the Saturday FPL Live for the three o'clock games. I hope you've really enjoyed all the goals that we've had to celebrate this afternoon. Um, but I, from a, my from my point of view, I need to I need to get going. Um, I know that Dre Zara has been with us with Paulie. Um, thank you ever so much, and I look forward to listening into your stream, Stevo, uh, for the Burnley Tottenham game later today. Um, so, guys, stay tuned for Stevo's stream. Um, I've got to go and um, look after a two and a half year old. So it's going to be fun and games. And I look forward to seeing you and speaking to you tomorrow. Take care. Bye, everybody.
See you in half an hour. Bye-bye, guys. Thank you.